Hey friends, how are you today? I hope you're doing great so far. I hope you're staying safe um, inside, doing as much as you can if you're able to be home. Do so. I really, really hope you're being safe. Um, but today I'm here to share my uh, spring makeup essentials. So these are products that come and go every time uh, spring comes around. And it's already springtime. It doesn't feel like it because I haven't left my house in like, it feels like a year. Um, I think I've been uh, inside for like two to three weeks and I'm going crazy already uh, but anyway it is what it is you have to be safe and that's what I'm trying to do uh, me and my kids are you know hanging out here at home if you hear the little voices I do apologize in advance and without further ado let's just start So let's start on the order that I will put, um, you know, stuff to my face. And I'm going to start with my primer. This is the one that I'm using today. It is the Pro Folder Hydrating Primer by Fendi. This is just a super nice and hydrating primer. It's not going to make your face look over hydrated or anything like that. It's going to send the wear off your makeup and it just looks super beautiful. It just feels like you're putting moisturizer on your face. It's super nice and like the scent is really soothing and I love it. I love it so so much. I used it all summer and I didn't feel like my face, like I said, uh, looked overly hydrated every time I, I, I put this uh, primer on. But today I'm putting it with uh, my Tatcha Silk Canvas Liquid. I feel like these two are great. This one you get a lot of moisture from it and then this one is just gonna help you, you know, with pores and mattify your T-zone. That's how I used it. So I only put a little bit of the Tatcha on my T-zone and then the Fenty all over my face and I feel like it's a great combo for spring. Uh, we're gonna see, I'm gonna change everything for summer but this is just springtime. I feel like spring is a great time for, you know, just light makeup, uh, dewy makeup but not like greasy makeup, right? So those two I feel like are a great combo uh, for springtime. Then for my foundation, the one that I'm wearing right now is the Summer Makeup Forever is the Reboot Foundation. I have uh, multiple videos talking about this one I just love so much this foundation I feel like it looks super healthy super nice and super dewy just looks super natural so I love it so so much it doesn't wear super long so I have to make sure that I have a good primer underneath and the silk canvas by Taja I find that uh, it makes it last a ton more so I appreciate that about those two together so those ones are really really nice but then if you want a little bit of um so that's a light foundation another light foundation that I love for springtime is this one by Dior is the Dior backstage foundation this one is just like the MAC um face and body foundation is super lightweight but it is waterproof it is sweat proof it's gonna last a ton on your skin you get a Mm, a good medium coverage with it uh, but you can always you know build it up or you can do concealer uh, over it so yeah those two foundations are gonna be my go-to for spring 100% another foundation that I wanted to mention is that one by Heart Candy I'm gonna put a picture up there I have it upstairs I, I don't want to run and get it but that one is a great foundation if you like mattifying foundation it is super affordable it is from the drugstore it's like seven bucks and it works beautifully it's a 16 hour foundation and I love it so so much so i wanted to recommend that one i'm gonna put again a picture up there for you to see as I said, for springtime, I like to be dewy, I like to be fresh, but I don't like to be greasy. So this is a product that I feel like it makes you look super nice and dewy, but you will never look greasy with it. Uh, depends on how you use it. I don't like to use it everywhere in my face. That's not how I roll. This one, I'll just put it on top of my cheekbones. It just gives me the nicest glow of time. It's not sticky. It's not like, you know, it's not gonna slip and slide my makeup everywhere. Nice. It is just a super nice product and it's just gonna make you look super nice and dewy so I really really like it for you know spring and summertime. I was one that like to set my makeup even though I have combo skin I don't only set my t-zone I set everywhere I like my makeup to stay put and I find that that way like if you set everywhere it's gonna last longer so a powder that I've been loving is this one by Pat McGrath I find that I look super flawless and super healthy and it's not it's not heavy at all it's super super lightweight and that's what I appreciate about this powder this time of year I don't like to kick up my makeup and I like to be free and I like my makeup to look you know just nice and 
natural. Uh, so this guy will do that for me and that's why I wanted to highly, highly recommend it for this season. For blush, I wanted to talk about this Natasha Denona Bloom palette. I need my creams during summer and springtime. Creams are a must for me. I need them in my life. I just feel like they make me look super nice, super healthy. I'm wearing this palette right now. I'm wearing the two cream shades at top. I just mix them. You have to have a light hand because they're super pigmented but this guy is gonna last you a while so I love these creams in here and e.l.f. does also have a cream palette I'm gonna show you a picture up there I've talked about this palette a ton it lasts a while it, you get like four pretty little uh, cream blushes and it's just a great deal so if you're looking for an affordable option um, that one from e.l.f. is beautiful uh, but if you want to splurge <laughs> this one by Natasha it can be big it's super super beautiful Beautiful. A similar product to the Natasha Denona is this on my Mac. It is one of their newest blushes. This one is uh, the Glow Play Blush in So Natural. I love the consistency of this product because it is one of those bouncy kind of products um, and it's just super, super super beautiful. It builds up really, really well. It builds up nicely. Um, it's super lightweight and it's super, super natural. The only thing that is uh, it doesn't wear too, too long. I feel like my my face just drinks up this thin and by five hours I have no blush uh, but I mean I like it because it looks super natural my cheeks so, look super healthy every time I use it so I wanted to highly recommend that one and then if you're looking for something a little bit um, you know more glowy and dewy I highly recommend this palette by uh, Charlotte Tilbury these two blushes in the middle are everything if you mix them together with this roll they just give you a super nice and healthy cheek for spring I feel like my cheeks need to be like really highlighted they need to look really healthy and dewy and juicy and that's just like my thing so I love love blush for springtime and because I already have a lot of glow going on on my cheeks I decided to go with a really light um, you know lightweight highlighter so this one by mac was my choice this, this is one of their extra dimension skin finish in the shade postmodernist this was one of their um the new the newer collection for spring um i have a video on it I, i'm gonna link it below but as you can see it's super super natural i'm wearing it right now and it just like you need to like if you want more glow you have to build it up and i did that today i'm really like digging my brush in it to like make it you know pop but it's just really natural you're not gonna you know you're not gonna get like super blinding highlight with this guy never ever um but yeah because i already have super dewy chicks i don't like to have extra you know highlighted um uh, cheekbones with highlight so i prefer to have glowy chicks and a little bit of highlight like natural highlight for uh, springtime so this one is a great great option a palette that I highly, highly recommend is this one by Colourpop. It is the Sweet Talk palette. Oh my god, you guys, this is a beautiful palette from this time of year. As you can see, the shades are just so peachy and that's what I go for. I'm wearing it right now and I just love the, just like the flash of color I just use two shades really blown out all over my you know my crease and my eyelids and I love it and then you do your liner and in my inner corners I have a little bit of this sparkle right here which is a beautiful beautiful sparkly shade it is one of those um you know I don't know how to call it uh, but it's all shimmer um you have to be careful uh, not to get it inside your eyes but yeah i like you know like my matte look with a liner that's like everything for me during springtime so i find that this is the perfect peachy palette for spring and summertime another palette that is super easy to carry is this one by fenty it is number five with the uh it is their peachy uh, palette i love this guy a lot i did a review on it but i just find it so so easy and portable uh for undergo like these shades the matte are really really nice they do build up quite nicely but then I do like pink as well so I wanted to recommend this one by Huda Beauty it is the nude uh, the light one I just find that I get a super romantic eye every time I go with uh, this palette and I like it a ton so for springtime peachy shades and uh, pink shades are like my thing 
For my lips today, I'm just wearing a liner, but I like uh, glosses, so I highly recommend this Fenty Beauty, their gloss bombs. And this was is in the shade Fuzzy, which is like my favorite one because it gives you a little bit of color, but it's nothing super, super overpowering. So you do get the flush of color. They smell delicious. They're not super sticky, they last a little bit, they last a K on your lips and they just make your lips super juicy and healthy. So I love these glosses by Fenty, any of the shades, um, you know, you can't go wrong with them. And then I finish off my makeup uh, by setting with my Glow Recipe Watermelon Mist. This is a go-to product for me for summer or springtime. I find that for undergo, you can refresh your makeup, the mist is just beautiful. I just I love it so so much. So this product is a must up a hundred percent. Alrighty friends, that was it for today. Thank you so, so much for being here. These are my must-have spring products, makeup products, beauty products. Let me know in the comments down below which ones are your faves. I would love to know. Do give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed and click that red subscribe button down there for more and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.